Hi, we're here at the Lion Brand Yarn Studio with the one and only, God help us, I hope there's only one, Franklin Habit. Mm. Welcome to New York. Thank you. You're I so think. welcome. <laughs> Are you ready to tear up the city? I am so ready. Excellent. I'm ready, yeah. Now, did you bring Dolores with you? No, Dolores stayed home. You are I never know. going to hear the end of this. Oh, I know. for for our I viewers know. who might not be familiar with Doris, can oh. you explain who Doris is and oh, how you Dolores met? Oh, Dolores is. Um, oh, Dolores. Oh, now I'm never going to hear the end of it. I just heard Doris. <gasps> yeah. Well, Dolores, um, Dolores showed up when I was a new spinner, and I had been given a spinning wheel, but I had nothing to spin. So a friend of mine who knows all about these things said, "This is what you do. You write to a fiber farm, and you request such and such." and then they will send it to you. And I thought, well, that seems reasonable. Sure, but there was a sure. bit of a mistake at the fiber farm, and instead of sending me uh, Romney roving, they actually sent me a Romney sheep. Hmm. And um, she sort of moved in to the joint, and mm -hmm. she hasn't left yet. I see. And, uh, and she's um, bewilderingly popular with people. She actually had a fan club. Yes. on Ravelry, the Dolores Devotees, was was ex was uh, founded before I even had an invitation to join Ravelry. Back yes, when it, was it, is, it is a very large group. In fact, we, we posted your talk um, on that group. That's nice, because yeah. you know the people that love Dolores are occasionally mildly interested in what it is that I might be doing in the background. Yes, now I, I didn't share with the group that she wasn't coming. I didn't know that oh, at the time. Uh, well, I wasn't aware of that, and I hope that's not going to be There's not problem. enough room in Manhattan for Dolores right I see. now. You know? yeah, there, I were, see. there were some issues during the Los Angeles Oh, we don't talk about that. Oh, okay. Yeah, sorry. Uh, there's there's legal issues. We just okay. we we let that go. Okay. So now, other than you know your your love for strange mm -hmm. wayward mammals who show up in your apartment, uh -huh. um, you have a few other passions: photography, mm -hmm. yes, yes, lace, mm -hmm. vintage patterns, Absolutely. all of which uh, you are going to be teaching here this yes, weekend, which yes, we're yes, thrilled yes, about. Yes, yes. Um, but tonight's talk is going to be all about strange vintage patterns. Can you tell me why, why and how? you came to love vintage patterns. Because they're just weird. And, and I just, I have a real affection for weird. You know, there's, um, the, the talk tonight will be focusing on patterns that were put out in the 19th century by um, a very, very uh, long-lived and, and really wonderful um, English publisher called Weldon's. And uh, Weldon and company um, were responsible for um, producing uh, hundreds of excellent patterns for knitting and that's what a lot of people know about what we're going to be looking at tonight is some of their stuff that maybe at least to our eyes is not so wonderful um and a lot of it is not museum knitting. of knitting strange and weird and wrong knitting strange weird and wrong um bent iron work excellent crinkled tissue paper art of course um uh, and you anything really with do human hair Nothing with human hair. Shoot. No, no. See, I, I mean, that's me some good human that's hair too, art. That's that seems macabre, but what what really amuses me is the stuff that um, it's not so much macabre, but it's just um, the nineteenth century equivalent of making stuff with popsicle sticks. You know, I love it. You look at these books and you realize that the the weird church bazaar kitsch yes. that your that your grandma made, you know, for the bazaar, that she would take it to the bazaar and all her friends would also make stuff and then they would buy each other stuff and it would just wind up in their houses. That's the kind of stuff we're going to be looking at. And it's, um, Very you excited. did put the warning on the website. I right? did. That, like, I did. Okay. And what was the warning? Just it's share it may, the warning. may induce seizures in persons with good taste. Because, it can happen. Yeah, pretty much nothing that we're going to see tonight is in in good taste. It's all very questionable. Now, I have to ask you about this this little volume that I'm oh, clutching to my lap. Oh, please do. Isn't it cute? Um, and I, you know, I hate to sound like your mother, but mm -hmm. um, this was adorable. Oh. What else are you going to write? Well, we'll see. That's 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 quite a loaded question because I've had I've taken a hiatus from from producing books oh. for several years. No, no, but it's about to end. Oh. Mm. So. It, did we hear it here first? Is mm, this an exclusive? Um, yeah, pretty much. Fantastic. So, yeah, because uh, this putting this book together was really a lot of fun. It's so, hysterical. and thank you. It is. Like, it's like small, but when I hold it, it seems like a large book. Yes. Right? See, it's a question of scale. <laughs> we're, um, we're very small people. We are. We're tiny. Makes a great holiday gift. We actually, we are in your screen right now. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'm going to be getting back to the to the to the book writing. I've contributed to other people's books in the meantime. Very um, excited. But and it will probably be 
you know, the typical kind of junk that I turn out. And, I'm excited know. for your junk. Well, thank you. I'm glad you like my junk. Um, so, well, I would, I'm very excited for your new book, and mm-hmm. I, I think I know a place that we could have the book launch. I am all for that. So, um, for all of you guys who couldn't join us here in New York City, we're so thrilled to have Franklin, and keep your ears and eyes open for Franklin's new book, and perhaps a book signing here at the Lion Brand Yarn Studio. I'll come play at your house anytime. Excellent. All right. Thank you so much. Bye from the Lion Brand Yarn Studio.